okay so now on our camera control script right after this start method we will say update and we will remove the comments from there okay now first of all what we're gonna do we will read the mouse inputs for rotation okay for the mouse x and mouse y rotation so for that what we're gonna do we will say float mouse x and this will be equals to input dot get axis okay and we want to get the mouse x rotation and what we're gonna do we will multiply that rotation by the sensitivity and the reason we multiplied by the sensitivity so that we can handle the mouse sensitivity on the x rotation okay and what we're gonna do we will do the same for our mouse y whoops let me actually copy this whole line like this and paste it down below and just simply change this to y and right here change the float name to minus mouse y as well okay so now we can read the inputs for rotation now after this what we're gonna do we will update the rotation values so as you know that we have the rotation y and the rotation x as you can see okay so first of all let's update the rotation x so we will say rotation x minus equals to mouse y okay then we will say rotation y plus equals to mouse x okay so once we update the rotation values now after this we will clamp the rotation values okay because as i told you in the first video that we will limit the camera rotation by the minimum x mini and maximum x values and also the minimum y and maximum y values okay so that the player don't rotate in both of the angles infinity okay we want to limit that so right here we will clamp the rotation values okay you can also add a comment if you want right here we are clamping the values so you can just say clamp rotation values okay so first of all let's start from the rotation x mathf dot clamp so right here first of all we will pass the rotation x then to the rotation x we want to pass the minimum x angle and then the maximum x angle okay so that the rotation x doesn't go infinity it will be limited by the minimum x and maximum x angle values okay and in the same way we can clamp the y rotation as well so we will say rotation y okay and we will limit that by minimum y and maximum y so now once you do that after this we want to smoothly interpolate the rotation okay so in order to do that we will say quaternion and let's name this as target rotation okay and this will be equals to quaternion dot Euler and in here we want to smoothly interpolate first of all the x rotation then the y rotation and for the z as you know that we can't rotate on the z so for that we will pass zero okay that is it now after this let's rotate our player camera transform according to the target rotation okay which we created right here and according to this uh, smooth speed okay 
and we will be rotating the camera with the time okay so that the rotation is smooth so in order to do that we will say transform okay then dot rotation and this transform dot rotation will be our camera rotation since this script is attached to our camera then we want to apply all of the things so for that we will say quadronian dot slurp okay and then we will say transform dot rotation okay we want to rotate the camera rotation so you will say transform dot rotation then first of all we will pass the target rotation then the smooth speed and we will multiply the smooth speed by time dot delta time okay that is all for this camera movement okay so now if we save the script and get back to unity now as you can see if we click on the camera everything is attached and ready so if you go ahead and play the game you will notice now that when we rotate as you can see the camera is rotating but if you notice the player is not rotating with the camera and as you can see it is showing the player whole body but and also the player doesn't move in the direction of the camera as you can see the player don't move in that direction okay so what we're gonna do we will add this code in our next video but now if you notice the camera let me show you okay if we click on the camera the camera can move to only minus 30 you can notice the rotation x of the camera okay which is minus 30 right here and if you move down as you can see it is 30 and on this side it can move to minus 360 and then plus 360 like this okay so everything else is working perfectly fine but now in the next video we will make the player move the direction of the camera view so for this see you guys in the next video